Nikki P is here to answer all your burning love questions. Long distance scares me. Well, if you're an avid listener of the podcast, then you know that me and Mr. Wright did long distance for two whole years. What is that? Lou! Oh! This can't keep happening. Mm, you storming up here and interrupting my work, so. Oh, you write jingles for cereal companies. Your job is no more legitimate than mine. Mike. Oh, well, right on cue. Mr. Weisel here has expressed deep interest in adapting your podcast to a book. I would like to invite you to join me at my annual writer's meet and greet at my estate. This is, this is like a dream come true. And one more thing. I'm afraid I'm going to have to insist that you bring along Mr. Wright. Mr. Wright? Wait, look, I have faked Mr. Wright's existence for long enough. What's one more weekend? No Mr. Wright, no book deal. You're gonna have to find a Mr. Wright by tomorrow. You can have noon to four. So you are really desperate, huh? Okay, so just remember, you need... Wait, how did you already stain these pants? Those were not cheap. It's fine, lay it's off. fine. Mr. Wright is aspirational. He is a successful human rights lawyer who minored in English literature and is an avid badminton, golf, and croquet player. We can't be risking any inconsistency. Uh -huh. Don't take me down with I'm you. I'm not trying to take you down. You are taking me down. Are you not? It was crazy to think this could work. Just hang, wait, wait. We can do this. We gotta be a team. To see the two of you in action, <laughs> you two seem to have something really special here. I can tell by the way you two look at each other. Well, what are we waiting for? <laughs> Fate works in mysterious ways. It does, doesn't it? It's a true love. I have feelings for you. See, I don't want to be your fake boyfriend anymore. If we tell the truth, then I lose everything. For years, you've sacrificed your love life for this facade. Sometimes I don't know if you're doing it for the podcast or if you're doing it because you're scared. I feel like I have found my real Mr. Right. He's nothing like what I've described over the years. Luke, he's so much better than all of that. <laughs>